because I was diligent, because my doctor was diligent, because of everything, I was diagnosed at a really early stage. That's very rare to happen. I didn't have to go through chemo and radiation and all those side effects and all those challenging things that people deal with. And I knew just, I knew I was so lucky in that I felt compelled really to do something to give back and to help people. And what I saw was just such a limited amount of supportive care. There's 23 countries in Sub-Saharan Africa and Asia that don't have access to radiation treatment at all. People would have to travel for days to get their treatment. Abandonment by family and friends because of stigma around cancer. I felt, again, compelled to do something to try to give back. went to Vietnam together to use the woman-to-woman -woman model to train as many cancer survivors as possible to be peer mentors to women who were diagnosed with different types of cancer. Our goal is to make sure that no woman has to face gynecologic cancer alone and we provide support psychologically, emotionally, financially, and in any way we possibly can. Make sure you go get your test. Make sure that if you have an issue, that you go talk to your doctor. And don't take no for an answer. You know your body, you know if something's wrong. Um, and only you can be the one in charge of that. So make sure that you are and feel empowered in that.